As mayor of Phoenix, I receive a daily briefing about what is happening as we fight coronavirus. We try to work with all of the healthcare systems and Maricopa County Public Health, the state public health. There is a team effort led by the county, but they keep us updated. We received an update that there are serious capacity concerns with the morgue at Abrazo Health. Abrazo serves a population that has been hit incredibly hard by COVID-19, and I'm deeply concerned. So many Arizonans are getting mixed messages, but the one I want to deliver is that we have capacity challenges right now. We're not at full capacity, but we need to be worried and take this seriously. Too many Arizonans have lost their lives. Okay. Uh, my reporting has shown that the county has been asked to get refrigerated trailers, possibly to store the bodies. Uh, what do you know about that? We understand that Maricopa County is looking for refrigerated trucks to store the bodies. Do, does anything indicate this is a larger problem beyond Abrazo? We are deeply concerned. After the Memorial Day holiday, we saw a surge in cases. I don't know what to expect after July 4th, but it's clear our hospital system is being stretched and we have lost thousands of Arizonans. Do you have any other indication from elsewhere that other hospitals might be facing the same issue? I do not have any indication that other hospitals have more capacity challenges like this one. Okay. I think it's also important to understand that deaths are a lagging indicator. They happen after people get sick, seek treatment. It takes quite a while from the first infection. So when we are seeing elevated losses of Arizonans, it's very late. We have to take steps before we get to this level. Did you ever think we'd see refrigerated trucks in Phoenix like we saw in Brooklyn, New York several months back? We are not facing the same challenge that New York City was, but it is deeply disconcerting that we have this challenge right now. We are five months into fighting the coronavirus.